So what do you think of Vlad right now? Um, I don't really know. <laughs> I really know. I don't really see many Vlads. Uh, probably, I don't think he's like super good. But when I do see Vlads, they seem really strong. I think Vlad's in that like one point where I don't think he's bad, but I don't think he's like super good or anything. He's just like an average to like maybe averagely decent champion. But that's maybe because not many people play him, so you don't really fucking know his true strength. I don't really know. I don't see Vlad's like at all. Speaking of the devil, let's go look up. I want to go look up Cupic really quick. Cupic is literally rank. Holy fucking shit. Cupic is rank two right now with a 65% win ratio with Seraphine. And it's a mixture. I would say. And the split between mid lane and AD carry is like 70% AD carry games and 30% mid lane games in his past 40. That's wild. That is absolutely wild. This fucking sucks, dude. I think we should die in a game. Who's your favorite jungle to play with? Probably Rek'Sai. Because if your jungle picks Rek'Sai, you know for a fact that he's gonna gank mid like 16 times. You know for a fact that you're getting a mid lane gank. Why does Seraphine always get banned? Because after somebody faces her once and realizes that if they don't win the game in the first 15 minutes, that they probably lose. So they ban her. You know what, that's actually like super fucking crazy. Cupic is actually insane at Seraphine. That's crazy. I can't win with Vex anymore, help. Vex is getting buffed soon, man. Stay strong, stay strong. She's getting buffs. Reverses Kendi, who is a one trick Azir. See how this goes. I leaned against Cupic. His out of lane team fighting is just really insane. Well, I mean, I don't think you, you don't play Seraphine for lane phase. I wanna see Vel'Koz meta. I don't think that will ever happen, sure. I think th the only way you'll ever see a Vel'Koz meta is if they just randomly give him like 50 million damage. What are your thoughts on Talia right now? I don't really know, dude. I feel like after like that one big Talia nerf, just no one plays her mid anymore. So I don't really know how good she is because I don't see them anymore. I only see them play, uh, I only see Talia's in the jungle now. I don't, I don't think, I can't even tell you the last time I seen a Talia mid. What's your favorite Dyna skin? Probably the uh, Lunar Goddess one. Yo, Shen, where's the taunt? <laughs> what the fuck's going on, dude? <laughs> what a fucking wild game. Challenger game, by the way. Yep. Just because we're Challenger doesn't mean we don't monkey around every now and then. Flash Thunder Tower there. Um, maybe if it wasn't in, in Azir, but going one for one versus an Azir is definitely losing for me. Like for sure, that's definitely losing. I, if Azir will always be more useful than me if he's same amount of kills. Good, good, you. I'm doing good. We're five and one today so far. And I have a fed Talia, which looks pretty OP into their team. It's going good. The only thing that's not good is Azir got some assists in the ball lane. Alright, that's good. Big. Dari's just so mad. Yeah, he kind of got fucked a little bit right there. Every time I turn on your stream, you're dying without fail. Well, I mean, I am a Diana one trick now, so. Doesn't that make sense? Help me! Big. Good job. 
tricky. Tricky! Tricky! Demons. Tricky. Diamond isn't slept on. I mean, I've been saying it. I would not be surprised if Dynamid got nerfed. If I'm doing this well on her in in like fucking Masters Plus, if someone was even like somewhat decent at her, like in fucking gold, I can't imagine the abomination that is Dynamid. And gold, if you're like some, if you're good at her. Yo, that's some bullshit right there. Tricky. I don't think that mid will get nerfed for play lay. It's really low. Yo, Data Wizard, you could say the same thing about Aurelian Soul, but then he he fucking got hit right in the fucking like right in the asshole. You could the same thing you could say the same thing about fucking Pike and Mid. This new version of Pokemon Newslock looks weird, Quant Pickle. <laughs> I think you can't Trox. Big. Where are you at, you old shit? Big. Yo, try. What's oh? Name a better Shen than me, by the way. Stefan M. Ross. Hmm. The guy said, "Name a better Shen than me, Stefan," and I said, "Stefan M. Ross." Big damage. Yo, I did 420 gold per minute. Babe, babe, can we please have normal sex tonight? No. Turn yourself into a horse. <laughs> Play the audio, I can't, it's really, it's really, really loud. <laughs> Turn yourself into a horse. Oh, here's another, like, a really, really good one right here, too. Why don't you own a horse? Reliable transport, zero emissions, only yeah. shit. 10, 10, almost a year. Runs on hay and water, can buy one for $1,000. Cost around 750 a year to maintain health. If it collapses, you can wait a few minutes and ride it 20 more miles. Doesn't require license, registration, or insurance. 4x4 off-road capability. Can trample anyone in your way. Let me do my runes really quick. Big on the runes. Let's do this one with the black chroma. You can drink and ride. Makes you look like a badass cowboy. Take the horse pill. Giga horse. <laughs> Nay. We should all own horses. That should, that should be the only transport of the entire world is horse. I'm right and you're wrong. Smile. <laughs> there are less horses than cars though. Yeah, I know. I'm just fucking with you, dude. Imagine how many horses that would be. That'd be, that'd be billions of horses. I've been playing AD carry so much today that I auto-pathed bot lane. See, y'all are all against the horses because you don't want to ride a horse. Yo, Swedish, you'll never understand. You'll just never understand. And that's fine. Why Taste of Blood over Sudden Impact? Taste of Blood is just better for lane. Sudden Impact's kind of a meh rune, to be honest. Dyna much prefers having a stronger lane phase rune than a, a rune that's, you know, I mean, obviously better later.
he lives that? Gremlin of a champion. Fuck, bro. I thought I would kill him, man. Man. You maybe want to start playing Diana, but damn, do I feel useless sometimes. Yo, Daniel, if it makes you feel better, sometimes Diana is extremely worthless mid lane. Sometimes it just, it is what it is. If you get a bad matchup and you get spam ganked, your champion is pretty fucking worthless mid. Should I take Corrupting Pot? I mean, how does Corrupting Pot change any? If, if anything, Corrupting Pot does less damage than Doran's. You don't get any AP. It was a joke. Ah, I didn't know if you were being serious or not. But still, someone might be- someone might have thought you were serious. We gotta make sure people are educated on the Diana school. Big! God, dude, just look at Yumi. Yeah, guys, can we get some clone threes in chat? Because we have a Yumi on our team, please. <laughs> Guys, did did uh? Oh. <laughs> you know what makes that like even funnier? First of all, like they just like ran past me. The Ari like ran past me for like two seconds, like she wasn't looking. And then on top of that, they missed everything. Yo guys, everyone in chat, how many of you guys are fucking lurking right now? That was pretty fucking funny. I, I didn't expect the chat to explode that hard. That's actually pretty fucking funny, man. You know, I expected like a few people to say like, yo, what's up? But like, it, chat literally just exploded. <laughs> Big... The plate! Oh, I stole it. <gasps> oh my god, I get the last plate at the one last second. Holy shit. I'm gonna go double large rod here. Yo, Quan, I got a question. Me and my buds debating. So we allegedly imitate a trade last second with random people in select. If they accept and we end up with troll champions, who fault is it? The person who initiates the trade or the person who accepts it? Ah, uh, I think you're both gremlins. To be honest, I think the initiator is probably more of the gremlin, but I think you're both gremlins. Wait, he just spun? I was literally, I was literally in his... It, it's fine. Talon. Absolute gremlins. All of you. Hey, Ari. Oh my god, my damage was thick. How many inches you got? We're at 4.8 right now. Oh my god, we did it with the speed boost. Hey, Ari. Oh shit, she's actually here. Listen here, you little shit. This demon just isn't looking at her fucking screen. So she keeps walking point blank into my fucking dick instead of turning around so I miss my cue. Where is our gromp? Okay. 
I gotta go kill someone. I'm sorry, Hannah. Alright, we got the frustration out a little bit. Big! Oh my god, we're thick! Wait, where'd my AP go? Ah, she's a proc the flowing water. Oh yeah, that, that water be flowing right now. Yeah, she, like, she wet wet right now. Guys, did anybody else hit that Jin when he got charmed? Or was that just Ari's damage while being 0 and 4? Why do I get the soul treatment? <laughs> oh no. He's sad that I played a soul versus him or with him. Poor guy, man. You know, to be fair, in his defense, it is like he got like a big. <sighs> Poor guy, man. Oh my.